Hello and welcome to my collection, I call it uh, the 2011 edition. These are the games I bought uh, from 2011. So I will show you something. We start with a new system. This was my 3DS and this is the only game I got till today. Pilot Wings is okay, but it's not really special. If you uh, need a 3DS, I think uh, maybe wait for Mario Kart 7. That is very better and I think I get it in the next days. So, this was a great 3DS. Talking about PSP, only two. This is third birthday, the third title of a Parasite Eve trilogy. Part one was awesome, never released in Europe, of course. Part two was not so good. And this one, yes, it's, it's a nice limited edition, but you don't really need that. And uh, Desodaya 012, also a question if you really need it. It brings nothing really new to the first installment. You have new characters, but it's not so interesting. If you're a Final Fantasy idiot like me, you have it, but it's not that necessary and important. Talking of a system that is totally dead, uh, for we Zelda Skyward Sword, nice, uh, some call it the Wind Waker in skies. Uh, yes, maybe that, that's true, it's okay, but it's not the greatest Zelda ever, but it's not a, a disappointment. It's okay, but nothing more. Speaking of disappointments, um, this limited edition is nice, but if you're really fan of a first Mario and Sonic uh, Olympic track and field games, you can get it, but it's not so interesting. Hmm. I have it, but don't ask me why. Talking about Xbox. Only two this year. Forza Motorsport. Very stylish racing. Very good. Also the limited edition is really nice. Um, so if you're a race fan, this may be the better Gran Turismo 5. This is Forza 4. If you have an Xbox, get it. Speaking of get it, Gears of War 3, maybe the best part of the whole trilogy. This game is awesome, very good game, just get it. The PS3. Speaking of trilogy, Uncharted 3, very good looking game, very nice, very playable. But on the story side, it's maybe weaker than the second part, but it's a good game. Of course, if you're a PS3, you need to have Uncharted. All three of them. WE12, uh, as a wrestling fan, of course I get it. Um, the Road to WrestleMania mode is not so great. The other things are very better. Uh, if you are a fan of wrestling, you have to get it because it's the best wrestling game of 2011, of course. Uh, there are no great rivals. Um, so it's, it's an okay game, but nothing more. Mortal Kombat, the reboot, the relaunch. This is one of the best games of the year. If you're ever a fan of this series, just get it. Awesome story, awesome beat-em-up. Very good game, just get it. From Rockstar, Alien Noir, a very adventure-like game with great facial expressions, great graphics, great storytelling. It's Rockstar reinventing the adventure genre. If you are a fan of a typical point-and-click adventures, this thing comes very similar to that. Um, it's a good game, it's very okay. Uh, I had a lot of fun with it. Speaking of sequels, of course, The Witcher 2 for the PC with soundtrack, bonus CD, the whole limited edition, really nice. If you are a collector, just get it just for the amazing uh, details you get. This is a very nice game, 
I don't know if it's really better than the first one. It's better looking, of course. But, uh, yeah, there well, are some points but weaker than the first one. But this is a really good game. Speaking of really good games, this may be the best game of 2011. Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. I think it's a great game, it's a little bit glitchy, you need a lot of patches. Um, if you are ever a fan of an RPG, you have to get it. Simple and that. Go get it, buy it, it's worth it. Arkham City. Also a very good game. Maybe not so strong as Arkham Asylum. This is more the open world version of Arkham Asylum, but it's a very good game. If you're ever a fan of a dark Batman, not the 60s Batman, you have to get it. It's that good. I'm a huge Dead Rising fan. I'm a huge Frank West fan. But I don't think if I really needed that sequel. It's nothing more like a DLC of Dead Rising 2 with, I think, two hours of new content with Frank West. Um, wait until it's cheaper, believe me. It's a good game, but if you have a second installment, it's nothing really new. Speaking of bringing fun back to the table, Bulletstorm and the... Uh, Advertisement game um, Duty Calls brought fun back in the game. I think it's the, the mixture of uh, Unreal Tournament meets Gears of War with a lot of fun. If you like a fun shooter, this is your kind of game. If you need a horror shooter, Dead Space 2 is a living gore fest. It's very good, very horror. It's it makes a lot of things. It's a little bit different when the first installment it goes more to the psycho horror. This is gore. Really gore. If you're a fan from the independent scene, get Magica. I call it just a Diablo clone, but that isn't really a case. This is a really fun RPG. Action RPG, can you call it? If you have a chance to get it, it's good. I don't uh, have to... Uh, I didn't have time to uh, look at the binding at Isaac, but I know this game is also very good. Uh, but Magica was really strong this year. Dead Island. Uh, not as good as the trailer, of course. But it's a nice open world zombie game. It's not really spectacular, but it's okay and I had a lot of fun with it. Of course, I need Monkey Island Special Edition. Both games are very good. And this special edition is very worth it. If you chance to get it, just get it. Ha ha ha! Should I say something? Duke Nukem Forever is my disappointment of the year. Simple and that. It's a boring bullshit. The Duke is nice, but the game is absolutely shit. My game of the year, of course. Portal 2, very good game, very good single player, very good multiplayer. If you ever wanted to get a game, just get this game. It's that good. The DLC was uh, bullshit, but the game was very awesome. So, thank you for watching this year, 2011. Uh, just for the Zelda fans, a little bit. Um, thanks for watching this year. I will continue my collection videos in 2012. It will be continued with a video pack collection. So, happy holidays. We see you in 2012. Happy New Year. Bye bye.